Hi everyone, I hope you are all doing well. If you frequent my Twitch streams lately, um, you'll know exactly where I am right now, and um, if you don't, well, um, this is obviously Minecraft. So lately, I've been playing a lot on a single player world that I created um, to try and help myself learn how to build better. Currently, we only have two builds. Um, I have this house. This is a starter house. I'm not supposed to live in this house forever. And we have a bridge that's outside. The bridge is the most recent thing that I've completed, but today I think I want to try and see if I can work on getting a greenhouse together. In the greenhouse, I'll be doing all of my farming, but I also want to have a section set for bees and flowers so we can have like a cute little indoor um, bee area. So I think that's what I'll be working on today in this video. So first things first, we need to find a place to build the greenhouse. I currently live in like an acacia forest area. We also have a, just a normal oak and birch forest over here. Um, so we've got we've got room we've got things that we can work with and it necessarily doesn't even need to be like by my house like i said we have the bridge that's over here that we could very easily just you know i mean we could cross the bridge and put it over there it really just depends on where i feel is the best so let's let's do some scouting and looking around and see if we can find something i think i like this spot here I'll have to fill in this hole, like this this hole here, but I think I like this spot. It's not super far from my house. My house is just over there. Um, and then, like I said, I can build a path. Um, I might fill this up. I'm not sure that, I'm not sure yet though. I'm not sure. I may fill it, I may not, I may just leave it. But let me go ahead and fill up this area. It's a good thing I have lots of dirt in my pockets. I think we're just gonna fill it to this dirt here like this dirt spot we'll leave the sand because i don't plan on doing anything with that and i'm not even sure if i'm really going to use this spot we'll see though all right so because this is going to be a greenhouse most of the walls if not all of the walls are going to be black anyways as i was saying most of the walls if not all the walls are going to be black so the only things that are going to be made with like solid blocks um is wood or it, it is, is the like the frame kind of of it, you know? The walls are just gonna be filled in, so we're just gonna use, we're just gonna use logs, oak logs. All right. So let me go ahead, let's go ahead and transition into a time lapse so you guys can um, watch me build up this frame. Okay, so now I've run to a point where I've ran out of wood, but this is where we're at right now. It doesn't look like much, all right? It doesn't look like much, I'm aware. We're looking at five blocks high for the walls, and then we're gonna do like, um, we're gonna do like a, a curved roof kind of thing, you know? Um, I'm sectioning off two parts, so we're gonna have a main area here. We're gonna have a sub area. <gasps> oh no. Oh, you're joking. Hello, heathens. It's not very kind of you. <gasps> oh, that's rude. Go on. You missed. Nice. <gasps> Enchanted? I require it. Give it. Alright, 
They're dead. There's so many arrows everywhere. Oh my gosh. Did I get it? I just got two normal crossbows. Ugh. Lame. Very lame. Am I sure that it, like, didn't fall anywhere else and I just missed it? Ugh. That's so lame. Alright. Anyways, as I was saying, I ran out of materials. Uh, so I need to go and chop down some more oak trees. So I think I'm gonna quickly do that and then... Uh, meet you guys back here after I've chopped down some oak trees. Okie dokie. I am back and I've got all of the materials I need to finish the frame of the house. Um, it is getting a little late though, so I don't know how much more work we'll be able to get done. Um, in fact, why don't we go sleep first and then we'll cut back to another time lapse. Oh look, wait, there's a log stuck in the tree. <gasps> there's a couple logs stuck in the tree. Look at that. Okie dokie. It's morning, and now we can go and start back working on our greenhouse. Oh, hold on. We have an unexpected vi visitor. Ugh. No, thank you. No, thank you. Sorry. Oh, okay. Now we can go and start working on the greenhouse again. Okay, anyways, back to the time lapse. Okay, so you remember how I said that I had all the materials I needed to finish the frame? Uh, well, I lied. I, I didn't, apparently. I, I, di I didn't have enough. I thought a stack and 17 was gonna be enough. It, it, no, it was not. Alright, anyways, um, I, I guess I have to go cut down more trees. So, um, I guess I'll meet you guys back here after I finish that. This time I promise I'm gonna get two stacks, two stacks of wood, just to make sure. Alright. I'll see you back here in a bit. All right. I'm back, and I have my two stacks. Two stacks of oak logs. There's no way, no way that I don't have enough now to finish the, the frame. The frame of the greenhouse. There's no way. Again, back to another time lapse. Oh no. Ah! Oh no. Oh no. This is why you don't build at night. Oh no. Okay. Okay. 
Oh gosh, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I'm running, I'm going, okay, I'm going to sleep. All right, note to self, never, never build at night. Never, never build at night. Just don't do it. For the most part, I think the frame is done. Ow, what the heck? That's very rude. That is, that is very rude. How rude. Anyways, I think the frame is mostly done. This is gonna be the, the opening, the doorway here. I guess I should probably, oops, mark that out as well. All right, so there's our doorway, that's our entrance. Here we have these other areas. I don't think I'm gonna block them off because the only things like, the only creatures that are gonna be in here are bees. And as far as my knowledge extends, bees don't ever really mess with crops. They don't really like, as far as I'm aware, they don't destroy crops. So I think it, it should be okay for me to leave these two areas open and then the bees can swap interchangeably. My idea is, is that we'll have our main crop area here. We'll have this be a bee area where there's flowers and stuff. And then this area back here will be a bee area. I think that's, I think that's like, we'll have two hives. I think that'd be good. I think that would be good. We'll see though, we'll see. All right, I have 45 logs. I imagine I probably won't need that many. Should I should get more though, I, sh I should get more. Every time I say that I don't think I'll need that many, I end up needing more. <gasps> a beehive spawned right next to my house. I promise you that wasn't there before. Oh my gosh, that's why that bee was over here. I was so confused as to why there was a bee over here. Well, I guess that just makes it a lot easier to get the two hives going. I can, you know, that, that hive will eventually fill with honey and then I'll have, I can go and get the other, the other hive, the honey from the other hive. All right, it's getting dark, but I'm almost done with the roof. So if I could just hold out until I'm finished with the roof. So this is where we're at with the roof, the framing of the roof. Now I need to um, empty my inventory and then go and get an astronomical amount of sand. So much sand. Now let's go get an astronomical amount of sand. Okay, I have a little over five stacks of glass in my inventory right now. Let's go ahead and start smelting that. It's not a whole, I mean, it's just, it's basically five stacks and two, like in two little pieces. But that being said, um, I don't know if we'll have enough coal for smelting the glass. I'm not sure, but we'll figure it out. We'll get as, we'll get as far with it as we can. And if we end up having enough, perfect. If not, then that's totally okay too. I'm going to sit here and wait for this glass to finish melting. Maybe read my book a little bit more while I wait. And I'll see you guys back here after I've uh, finished smelting the glass. I don't know how long that'll take, but we'll figure it out. It took so long. It took, it took forever really but i finally have my five stacks of glass all smelted i i can't even begin to describe to you how long this took i think i read like four like three or four full chapters in my book in the time that it took me to smelt all this glass it took forever but i have it and we can start working on the greenhouse and finishing it up so let's go ahead and do that
Okay, well, I thought I had enough glass, but apparently five stacks was still not enough. So I'm gonna have to go and get some more, uh, some more glass. Ugh, all right, let me go do that and we'll uh, meet up back here. All right, another chapter in my book down and we have our glass that we smelted in the furnace. Finally, let's go and finish the walls of the greenhouse and then we can start filling it and decorating it, which I'm excited for. It'll be my favorite part, actually. And there we go. Now we've got the glass all filled. Oh, no, I lied. Hang on. <laughs> I forgot about these roofs in here. Oh, no. Okay, there we go. Now we're done. Now we've got all of the glass filled with 42 blocks to spare. Oh, goodness gracious. Okay, so now we can start, I can start thinking about how I want to fill these areas in here. Like I said, this is supposed to be like the main greenhouse area. So this is where we'll be doing a lot of our um, growing of vegetables and crops and stuff. So, I'm thinking what I want to do is this back here will be a canal for water. We'll have water back here. Okay, so this is what I've got figured out. I'm thinking what we can hopefully do is fill these bottom parts with water and then I can put glass on top that's what I'm hoping I can do so I can just walk over it like a like a water bridge kind of I'm hoping that's what I can do or alternatively I could try and go and look and see if I can find some lil some lily pads <laughs> I can look and see if I can try and find oh my I can look and see if I can try to find some lily pads and then make make the crossing that way the more that i think about it the more that i think i'd rather do that so now for the b rooms over here on each side here we're gonna have some dirt built up that's gonna look like planter boxes so and that way there's gonna be like flowers in them and here i'll just take bone meal in here and turn it into just a really pretty like grassy flowery area and we'll do the same for in here as well. I want these two rooms here to be as identical as I can possibly get them. So, two there, and then like that. All right, let's go quickly make some bone meal and get some uh, trap doors. Let me put the trap when you put the trapdoors like this, it looks like a little planter box. It's so cute. And then just boop. Woo! Just enough trapdoors. Oof, the luck. All right, everyone. With this greenhouse pretty much being built, I think I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this video here. Please be sure to check out the description for all my social medias and to check out my Twitch streams. I guarantee you that I will be playing more Minecraft next week. Typically, I am a variety gamer, so I don't like to really stick to one game that I stream, but I can guarantee you next week I probably will end up streaming a lot of Minecraft, so please be sure to check out my Twitch. Um, my Twitter is also listed there. My Instagram should be listed there as well, but I don't really post a lot of Minecraft stuff there. Um, with that being said, thank you guys all for watching this video, and I'll see you later. Goodbye!